don't puff your cheeks. What's up everyone, Scott Sutherland here. It's Tuba Tuesday, and if you are a low brass player, you've probably heard a teacher say that. Telling a student to stop puffing their cheeks is not very effective and doesn't get to the heart of what they need to do to become great brass players. Why? Well, first of all, telling someone to not puff their cheeks is like me saying, don't think of a pink elephant. Now, what did you think of? Yeah, probably that. So how can we frame this instruction in a more affirmative way? It comes down to what we actually need to do to form a great embouchure. Firm corners and a firm chin. This creates the structure necessary to free up the lips to respond effectively to the airstream. Mm. Follow me for more tips. Check out scottsutherlandmusic.com and I'll see you next week.